Second year medical student Katrina Taylor grew up on a ranch outside Warner in southeast Alberta. While her parents were partial to black Angus cows, they let Katrina explore her own passions in agriculture. Even to my parents' dismay, I got a few Herefords and I had my little Hereford herd. I raised exotic chickens for about five years just because I was really interested in it. Growing up with a love for ranching, what motivated her to switch to a career in medicine? I started volunteering in the Milk River Health Centre when I was 16, and I just loved it. I loved the people, I loved the community. In her first year of medicine, she did a pre-clerkship in Tabor. She followed a physician who practiced to full scope. Katrina quickly fell in love with rural medicine. It's so cool. And I got to assist on the surgeries. And then I walked out and we got to deliver a baby. And then we walked out and we like went to the ER and we I got to uh, suture a gentleman's face. Katrina co-leads a mentorship group where med students who are currently doing a rural clerkship encourage urban med students to give rural a try. I spent my whole life in rural communities. I completely believe that everybody's super accepting and super warm and super welcoming. For students coming in from urban areas, it's the fear of the unknown really prevented them from doing a rural clerkship and I think this really helped. Katrina's tireless efforts promoting rural clerkships have helped to drive numbers up. Last year, there were 26 applicants to the University of Calgary's rural clerkship program called UCLIC, compared to the 15 the year before. For her third year of medicine, Katrina will be doing a 32-week rural clerkship in Rocky Mountain House. Congratulations, Katrina, on being selected as a recipient of the $5,000 RPAP Rural Medical School Award. Yay!